Hi everyone, I'm Ange Tra and I'm here today with Chef Roberto from Aqua e Farina. So tell us about your food and the kind of food you like to make. Our recipes are basically old. We are very, very basic in our ingredients, but we try to focus on quality. We tried the calamari earlier yeah, on. Delicious. Calamari come from Italy are super, super tender. It's tasty. It's yeah. tender, lovely texture. What do you think about sustainability while running your restaurant? When I heard about the possibility to use a different kind of uh, palm oil, you know, I think I was I was very happy to hear that. So the palm oil we use only in two dishes, like, like one we just mentioned, the, the calamari, and the other one is our zeppole, sort of translated like donuts or Italian. Italian donuts to make it. How do you say it again? Zeppole? Zeppole, yes. Zeppole. It's, a, it's a dish or a, yeah, a dish or something typical like a street food. And more than anything else, do you, it's, has it been cost effective for you guys? It's not different. So it's only maybe one, two dollars, which I think I'm very happy to pay for this extra dollar and try to be uh, green in a way and uh, try to do our part. I cannot wait anymore. I must eat the food. <laughs> oh, okay, yes, yeah, please go, 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 go I go. must yes. eat. But you've got to tell me, like, um, while in Singapore, like, what do you think about the haze? I had a smell of haze, I, I presume, last night. I don't know, last night, like two, two, two nights ago. It's been happening the last few days, yeah. Were, were you surprised to find out that something that you do could be related to the haze? Like, you know, like impacted the haze? Four, three, four years ago, I say, what, what can I do? This is the oil people provide me and uh, I'm not sure where it comes from or so I can't tell. Yeah. But now to hear there is people introducing uh, these, these kind of things that make me super, super happy. I don't need to do nothing basically. And just, <laughs> just to call uh, one supplier or the other. I think it's very important to create that awareness because I think a lot of people who go out to restaurants and have food don't realize that the haze that they're breathing has some kind of impact to us. Even if something as simple as eating out and food and the kind of oil we use. Are you going to have one with me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think hands, hands is the best to, right? to use. Yeah, you you can't eat a donut. Well, people, some people <laughs> use fork or so maybe they're not familiar. But I think I'm the best, I think okay. the best, the best is just, just like that. Dip it in Nutella. Well, I just, uh, uh, I think the the outside doesn't get much. It doesn't get much. Oh, so that's the right way to uh, eat I'm, it. Don't I'm, do what I'm doing. I'm, no, it's okay. Also. <laughs> <laughs> but you see, there is always some some left. So I, I break into two. Nice range. That is really good. Can't stop. You me both. That's really, really, really good. I hope we can actually create more awareness to changing and switching into sustainable oil, and of course, supporting all the businesses that that support RSPO and sustainable oil. Thank you, Chef okay. Roberto. Welcome.